It's a foot candle measure. It measures light in foot candles. Okay. It also does an information light for acne. <laughs> So would you say there's too much or too little light in this room here? It's too much. There's 46 feet in time. All right, we have to find the area of the room. And to find that, we have to time them time. This is an instrument for the temperature of the room and humidity. The temperature of the auditorium is 79.2. Um, we're working on a power analyzer. That's the wattage. There's the um, voltage. But the thing with the computer is, is that when it's on it, you uses just as much electricity when it's off. You collect a lot of data. What are you going to do with it? What have you determined from your the data that you've collected there? Um, that some appliances should be unplugged when they're off. Yes, it can. We have a special treat this morning. We have, you know, kids actually taking a very uh, leadership role. We're working with the Green School Program to help the environment while we're in school. The, main, the goal of this project is to reduce the amount of electricity we use. The refrigerator in Global, they have the three refrigerator and... <laughs> <laughs> watching you every time you <laughs> Today I'm going to give you tips on how we can conserve electricity here at Pentreedy. First, the first tip is simple. Don't leave lights burning in an unoccupied room. Next, even if the computer is on a screen saver, Ms. Forte, it is using a lot of energy. Computers must be shut off when they're not being used. I mean, we talk so much about project-based learning, but this is really it at its best.